Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which, in which we partake of Christ, Christ. His, His sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled, filled with His grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food, and this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you give us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you want for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we, we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ your Son was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate on the sorrowful mysteries. The first sorrowful mystery, the agony of our Lord in the garden. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second sorrowful mystery, scourging of our Lord at the pillar. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third sorrowful mystery, crowning of our Lord with thorns. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth sorrowful mystery, carrying of the cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth sorrowful mystery, crucifixion and death of our Lord. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy, Holy Mother, Mother of God. God. Despise not, not our petitions and our, and our necessities, necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever-glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawak, pray for us, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech you, that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary, of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward, whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him with a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of Saint Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. 
Amen. Jubilee prayer for the golden anniversary of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, Advocate and Guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you. Let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all. In the gospel we share with all peoples, by your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. Today is Friday of the 21st week in Ordinary Time. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth, mouth shall declare your praise. Come, let us give thanks to the Lord, for his great love is without end. Come, let us give thanks to the Lord, for his great love is without end. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, Amen. let us give thanks to the Lord, for His great love is without end. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in His hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to Him, the dry land too, for it was formed by His hands. Come, let us give thanks to the Lord, for His great love is without end. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord, our Maker. For He is our God, and we are His people, the flock He shepherds. Come, let us give thanks to the Lord, for His great love is without end. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Massa, they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Come, Come let, let us give thanks to the Lord, for his great love is without end. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, There are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I saw in my anger they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us give thanks to the Lord, for His great love is without end. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us give thanks to the Lord, for His great love is without end. Please be seated. Lord, you will accept this true sacrifice offered on your altar. 
Have mercy on me, God, in your kindness. In your compassion, blot out my offense. Or wash me more and more from my guilt, and cleanse me from my sin. My offenses truly I know them. My sin is always before me. Against you, you alone, have I sinned. What is evil in your sight, I have done. That you may be justified when you give sentence, and be without reproach when you judge. O see, in guilt I was born, a sinner was I conceived. Indeed, you love truth in the heart, then in the secret of my heart teach me wisdom. O purify me, then I shall be clean. O wash me, I shall be whiter than snow. Make me hear rejoicing and gladness, that the bones you have crushed my revive. From my sins turn away your face, and blot out all my guilt. A pure heart create for me, O God, put a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, nor deprive me of your Holy Spirit. Give me again the joy of your help, with a spirit of favor sustain me that I may teach transgressors your ways, and sinners may return to you. O rescue me, God, my helper, and my tongue shall ring out your goodness. O Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For in sacrifice you take no delight, burnt offering from me you would refuse. My sacrifice, a contrite spirit, a humble, contrite heart you will not spurn. In your goodness, show favor to Zion. Rebuild the walls of Jerusalem. Then you will be pleased with lawful sacrifice, holocaust offer on your altar. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. All the descendants of Israel will glory in the Lord's gift of victory. Truly with you, God is hidden the God of Israel, the Savior. Those are put to shame and disgrace, who vent their anger against Him. Those go in disgrace, who carve images. Israel, you are saved by the Lord, saved forever. You shall never be put to shame or disgrace in future ages. For thus says the Lord, the Creator of the heavens, who is God, the Designer and Maker of the earth, who established it, not creating it to be a waste, but designing it to be lived in. I am the Lord, and there is no other. I have not spoken from hiding, nor from some dark place of the earth. And I have not said to the descendants of Jacob, Look for me in an empty waste. I, the Lord, promise justice. I foretell what is right. Come and assemble, gather together, you fugitives from among the Gentiles. They are without knowledge who bear wooden idols, and pray to gods that cannot save. Come here and declare in council together, who announced this from the beginning and foretold it from the old. Was it not I, the Lord, besides whom there is no other God? There is no just and saving God but me. Turn to me and be safe, all you ends of the earth, for I am God, there is no other. By myself I swear, uttering my just decree and my unalterable word. To me every knee shall bend, by me every tongue shall swear, saying only in the Lord are just deeds and power. Before him in shame shall come all who vent their anger against him. In the Lord shall be the vindication and the glory of all the descendants of Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us go into the God's presence, seeking for joy. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before Him, singing for joy. Know that He, the Lord, is God. He made us, we belong to Him. We are His people, the sheep of His flock. Go within His gates, giving thanks. Enter His courts 
with songs of praise. Give thanks to him and bless his name. Indeed, how good is the Lord, eternal, his merciful love. He is faithful from age to age. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. O God, who caused the minds of the faithful to unite in a single purpose, grant your people to love what you command and to desire what you promise that amid the uncertainties of this world, our hearts may be fixed on that place where true gladness is found. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the first letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians. Brothers and sisters, Christ did not send me to baptize, but to preach the gospel, and not with the wisdom of human eloquence, so that the cross of Christ might not be empty to its meaning. The message of the cross is foolishness to those who are perishing, but to us who are being saved, it is the power of God. For it is written, I will destroy the wisdom of the wise, and the learning of the learned I will set aside. Where is the wise one? Where is the scribe? Where is the debtor of this age? Has not God made the wisdom of the world foolish? For since in the wisdom of God, the world did not come to know God through wisdom, it was the will of God through the foolishness of the proclamation to save those who have faith. For Jews demand signs and Greeks look for wisdom, but we proclaim Christ crucified, a stumbling block to Jews and foolishness to Gentiles. But to those who are called, Jews and Greeks alike, Christ, the power of God and the wisdom of God, for the foolishness of God is wiser than human wisdom, and the weakness of God is stronger than human strength. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The earth is full of the goodness of the Lord. The earth is full of the goodness of the Lord. Exalt you just in the Lord. Praise from the upright is fitting. Give thanks to the Lord on the harp. With a ten-string lyre, chant his praises. The earth is full of the goodness of the Lord. For upright is the word of the Lord, and all his works are trustworthy. He loves justice and right. Of the kindness of the Lord, the earth is full. The earth is full of the goodness of the Lord. The Lord brings to naught the plans of nations. He foils the, the designs of peoples. But the plan of the Lord stands forever, the designs of his heart through all generations. The earth is full of the goodness of the Lord. Please stand. at all times and pray that you may have the strength to stand before the Son of Man. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus told his disciples this parable. The kingdom of heaven will be like ten virgins who took their lamps and went out to meet the bridegroom. 
Five of them were foolish and five were wise. The foolish ones, when taking their lamps, brought no oil with them, but the wise brought flasks of oil with their lamps. Since the bridegroom was long delayed, they all became drowsy and fell asleep. At midnight there was a cry, Behold, the bridegroom, come out to meet him. Then all those virgins got up and trimmed their lamps. The foolish ones said to the wise, Give us some of your oil, for our lamps are going out. But the wise ones replied, No, for there may not be enough for us and you. Go instead to the merchants and buy some for yourselves. While they went off to buy it, the bridegroom came, and those who were ready went into the wedding feast with him. Then the door was locked. Afterwards, the other virgins came and said, Lord, Lord, open the door for us. But he said in reply, Amen, I say to you, I do not know you. Therefore, stay awake, for you know neither the day nor the hour. Dear friends, sisters, and brothers, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Good morning and welcome po sa Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawan. Mahira po kapag ka hindi tayo handa. I had this experience when I was a young priest, one year in the ministry, at uh, I just finished a Mass that was assigned to me. And the priest was already, the next priest was already waiting, and it is a funeral mass. At uh, bigla siyang sabi, Roland, pakipalitan mo naman ako, emergency lang. Sabi ko, uh, uh, okay, ano magagawa natin, di ba? Emergency nga eh. So, I had to say the mass again, it was a funeral mass. And usually, well, I don't really know, uh, those I celebrate funeral mass for. So, kinuha ko doon sa listahan ko anong pangalan. Ang pangalan, Rosario. E di ho ba ambiguous yung Rosario? Ito ba'y babae o lalaki? Tapos tinignan ko yung casket, titignan ko sana kung babae o lalaki. Na, nakasara na yung casket. Wala naman ako mautusan kung tatanungin kung sino man yung naandoong uh, magmimisa kung babae o lalaki. But anyway, it was already time for me to say the Mass. May pinsan ho kasi ako, babae, Rosario. So ginawa ko na lang sa mga pronouns doon sa Misa, she. Buti na lang hindi nagalit yung mga kamag-anak nung namatay. May lumapit sa akin, Father. Lalaki po siya. Ah, okay. So, in other words, it was very embarrassing for me. I cannot explain. Hindi ko naman pwedeng ipaliwanag doon sa mga tao na nag-emergency yung naka-assign na pari. Eh, kadalasan, kapirasong papil lang yung binibigay sa amin. Just the name. So, it's very difficult for us to be caught flat-footed at hindi prepared. Kahit anong bagay, di ba, kailangan meron tayong paghahanda. Dalawang klase ang paghahandang alam natin, yung tinatawag nating proximate, yung matagal pa, kagaya ng naalarawan sa ating ibanghelyo ngayon, matagal dumating yung bridegroom. So, they had time to actually to buy the, the oil for their lamps. Kaya lang, pare-pareho, all of those virgins, the five wise ones and the five foolish ones, they had the same uh, they had the same environment, ika nga. Pare-pareho na inantok sila sapagkat nakakaantok naman talagang maghantay. Pero hindi sila nag-prepare ng extra flask of oil. Pero yung lima nag-prepare. So they had to buy it pa outside. They were not prepared. E mahirap po, kadalasan naman sa ating mga ginagawa, sa ating ginagawi, sa ating uh, pang-araw-araw na buhay, we prepare sa pagluluto. Kahapon pa lang, namalengke na tayo, alam na natin kung ano iluluto natin sa umaga, di ba? So there is such a thing as proximate preparation. And there is also what we call the remote, or the, the, the remote, yung matagal, at yung proximate, yung malapit na. 
para din yung pagkasasakay ka ng aeroplano, di ba? Merong uh, pre-departure at meron ng boarding area. Kung makikita natin ito ay parang journey din natin sa buhay natin, parang our spiritual journey, dadating at dadating tayo sa oras na tayo ay di-depart na, lilipad na tayo. Does this mean yung ating kamatayan o pagtutuos when we will encounter the Lord face to face? Pwede. Pero sabi nila, it is also about our journey, yung buhay natin, our spiritual life. Pwedeng mag-suggest ang mga tao. Kung meron tayong spiritual director, they can only suggest, they can only make advice. But who makes the final decision? Yung tao mismo. Kaya nga yung foolish virgins, they made the decision not to buy extra flask of oil. That was their decision. So this story is not about the wise virgins being selfish. No. It is about our preparation. Kasi nung unang panahon, ang gospel writer natin, si Matthew, they were thinking that very imminent na ang pagbabalik ng ating Panginoon. But it takes time. It can happen in our lifetime. Maaring hindi. Kaya nga, noong nagkaroon ng malakas na lindol, uh, yung iba sa atin, alam ko anong gagawin, di ba? Sapagkat tayo ay nagkakaroon ng mga exercises. Ang, uh, ang National Risk Reduction uh, Commission ay nagbibigay ng mga uh, araw kung saan tayo ay magpa-practice kapag kalumindol. Duck cover and hold so that it becomes second nature to us hindi tayo magpapanik kaya nga yung iba sa amin anong ginawa mo nagtago sa ilalim ng table so it becomes second nature na ganun din ang ating buhay spiritual we have to prepare whether we like it or not kahit papaano di ba hindi tayo matatakot hindi tayo magpapanik hindi tayo magpapanik we know what we are going to do Especially in our spiritual life, huwag na natin ipagbukas-bukas pa, di ba? Uh, this moment is good enough for us to prepare. Kaya nga tayo na andito at nagmimisa. This is also a kind of preparation. Every day, lalong-lalo doon sa mga everyday mass goers, this is a good time for us to prepare when we are going to encounter our Creator. So let us pray na hindi tayo matakot, tayo ay maghanda hanggang sa ating makakaya. We now stand to offer our prayers and petitions. The gospel message reminds us to be wise and vigilant. As we wait for the coming of the Lord Jesus, let us pray for the world He has redeemed. For each intention, we shall say, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer that the church may read the signs of the times and constantly remind God's people of the eternal dimension of life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That young people may remain hopeful and enthusiastic about life. May their idealism aid them in pursuing great things in life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer that those discouraged and wounded by life may not grow bitter, but draw fresh strength and hope from Christ, who promised us His presence. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the sick and the dying may look to Christ with hope and penitent trust. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For our Pope, the College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, and for all those whom we promise to pray, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For vocations and the needs of the province, and for our brothers and ministry at St. John Lateran and St. Albert the Great, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions, Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That those who have died may join the Lord in His kingdom forever. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Father of time and eternity, grant the petitions we have made as we wait for the coming of Christ. 
your gift of eternal wisdom. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and the glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. O Lord, who gained for yourself a people by adoption, through the one sacrifice offered once for all, bestowed graciously on us, we pray, the gifts of unity and peace in your church, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for in goodness you created man, and when he was justly condemned, in mercy you redeem him through Christ our Lord. Through him the angels praise your majesty, dominions, adore, and powers tremble before you. Heaven and the virtues of heaven and the blessed seraphim worship together with exaltation. May our voices, we pray, join with theirs in humble praise as we acclaim. Them like the Jew fold, so that they may become for us 
the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith. As we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, Socrates, our Bishop, Fidelis, his auxiliary Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Blessed Joseph, her spouse, the Blessed Apostles, Saints Dominic and Francis, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may marry to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. all stand. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we now dare to pray. Our Father, who art, who art in, in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy, thy name. name. Thy, thy kingdom, kingdom come, come. Thy, thy will be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give, Give us this day our daily bread and forgive, forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as we forgive, forgive those who trespass, trespass against us. us. And lead, and lead us not, not into temptation, temptation but, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, 
and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us now offer to one another Christ's sign of peace. Say pong lahat. Peace be with you. Lamb of God, you take, take away the, the sins, sins of the world. world. Have mercy Christians. on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Please kneel. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Please all stand. The Lord has come to his people and set them free. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised, raised up, up for us a mighty Savior, Savior born, born of the, the house of his servant, servant David. David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of all that he would save us from our enemies from the hands of all who hate us. He promised, he promised to, to show mercy, mercy to our, our fathers and, and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he sorrowed to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, you my child, shall, shall be called the prophet of the, the Most High. High. For you, For you will go, go before, before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, 
and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory, Glory to, the to the Father, and to, and to the Son, and, and to the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. <clears throat> Amen. The Lord has come, come to his people and, and set, set them, them free. Let us pray. Grant that you are faithful, O Lord. Complete within us, O Lord, we pray, the healing work of your mercy, and graciously perfect and sustain us, so that in all things we may please you, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Once again, thank you very much, Paul, for being one with us in the celebration of the Holy Eucharist. Uh, please continue to pray for our work, for the work that we are doing here in this part of the Philippines. Hindi po madali to be of service to people from all over the world. Makakaasa din po kayo na kami ay magdadasal at mananalangin para sa inyong mga intentions at sa inyong mga hinihiling sa ating mahal na bilhin ng Santo Rosario ng Manawag at sa kanyang anak. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you all, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. We shall now have the prayer for the blessing of the sick and for the blessing of rosaries and other religious articles. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health. Through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. And in memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may these rosaries, images, candles, oil, and other religious articles be blessed and made holy. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. 